Red Dead Redemption 2 is peppered with disturbing secrets to uncover, many of which you might have overlooked while on the run from the law. So I'm here to show you some of the weirdest, creepiest and most disturbing details the game has to offer. Throughout the game you will come across some gruesome scenes, but few quite as disturbing as those left by a deranged serial killer. There are three locations where he's left behind the mutilated corpses of his victims, along with messages and clues on how to find him. Oh, Jesus. <sighs> Collect all three clues and you'll be led to the basement of a destroyed cabin. God. Inside, you'll find letters, knives, and the dismembered remains of even more victims. <laughs> Have you come for me? Or was this all nasty surprise? Or maybe it's both. You're eventually able to get the upper hand and subdue the killer before taking him to a local sheriff. But it's clear that no amount of rehabilitation will save this man's soul. You get in that cell, come as you be. Another crazy character is Mrs. Braithwaite, but it's her secret that's far more disturbing. It's easy to overlook, but the first clue appears during the Course of True Love missions when Bo Gray says this. You know, Catherine Braithwaite's got a daughter. No one's seen her in years. She were not right, you know, and Penelope said... I, I ain't heard about daughters. I heard about gold. It's seemingly a throwaway line that's brushed away quickly. However, if you go explore the back of the Braithwaite's estate, you'll eventually hear a woman's voice muttering, coughing, and grunting. Uh, who are you? Who's out there? Somebody's out there. The source of the sound is coming from a wooden outhouse, locked tight with heavy metal chains. This poor girl is almost certainly Mrs. Braithwaite's other daughter, and it seems she didn't want the public to know about her existence, but she also couldn't bear to have her daughter killed. And this was her solution. In New Hanover, you can find a dilapidated wooden building that looks like many others in the area, but inside, things start to get weird. Beds filled with the long dead remains of various people line the walls, bloody sheets clinging to their bones, and at the end of the room is a desk with another skeleton sat behind it. On the table, there's a note titled Mysterious Sermon, which talks about aliens and suggests that this was some kind of suicide pact with the goal of being taken by the aliens. Crazy, right? Why didn't you tell me we had guests coming? I'd have fixed myself up nice. Oh, now you know you look perfect, princess. <laughs> A lot of the strangers you meet in the game are pretty weird, but one of the most disturbing pairs can be found south of Emerald Ranch. Mmm, that smells delicious. <laughs> the food don't smell too bad neither. Oh, stop it, you! <laughs> If you take the couple up on their offer of dinner and a drink, two things become apparent quite quickly. First, they're not shy about their affection for one another. And secondly, their brother and sister. You know what? This place used to be a pig farm when we was when we were kids. Before we lost our ma and pa. Horrible business. Horrible. But we still got each other, ain't that right, honey pie? And we still know how to have a whole killing time. Upstairs, you can find pictures of the family from when they were younger, with the parents' faces scratched out. And if you do continue to dine with the couple, 
They'll eventually drug you, steal your cash and dump your body in a mass grave of what appears to be their previous victims and possibly their parents. Thankfully, revenge is an option. A nice hat is an important part of any good outlaw's attire, but for some individuals that doesn't go quite far enough and for them there are a number of disturbing masks to be uncovered. For example, you can get your hands on a very creepy manhunt style pig mask at a slaughterhouse. Hey there partner. Why you hide in your face? We don't take kindly to outsiders around here. However, if that's not quite disturbing enough for you, how about taking a ram skull off a mutilated corpse that was being used in some bizarre ritual? <laughs> ma'am? You okay, ma'am? Talk to me. The night folk can be found in the bayou and are a terrifying bunch. They set traps to get the attention of those passing through the swamp, whether it's a lone woman crying or a body hanging from a tree. Then, once you get close enough, they strike, rushing you with knives. So, if you're riding through the swamps at night and see something strange, just keep on moving. These are just the discoveries we've made so far, but there are undoubtedly more disturbing secrets to uncover, so please let me know what we've missed in the comments below. As always, this is James Fakas saying thanks for watching, and enjoy the game.